How to create distribution list in Outlook from Excel? Have you ever found yourself juggling a long list of contacts in Excel and wondering how to easily manage them in Outlook? Creating a distribution list in Outlook from your Excel contacts is simpler than you think. First, you need to prepare your Excel file. Make sure your contacts are organized in a way that each column represents a specific piece of information, like first name, last name, email, and so on. Save this Excel file as a CSV, comma separated values file. To do this, go to the File menu in Excel, select Save As, choose CSV from the drop-down menu, and save the file to a location like your desktop. Next, open Microsoft Outlook. At the top of the Outlook window, click on the File tab and select Open and Export, then choose Import Export. This will open the Import and Export wizard. Here, select Import from another program or file and click Next. Now, you'll need to choose the file type to import. Select Comma Separated Values and click Next. Browse to the location where you saved your CSV file and select it. Under Options, decide how you want to handle duplicates. You can choose to replace existing contacts, create duplicate contacts, or not import duplicates at all. Click Next and select the destination folder for your contacts. Contacts should be selected by default, but if it's not, find it in the list. You can also choose a different folder or create a new one. The next step is crucial. You need to map your CSV file columns to the corresponding Outlook contact fields. For example, if your CSV file has a column for phone number, you need to match it with the business phone or home phone field in Outlook. Once you've mapped all the fields correctly, click Finish. Now your contacts are imported into Outlook. To create a distribution list, go to your Contacts section, select the contacts you want to include in the list, and right-click to choose New Contact Group. Name your group and add the selected contacts to it. You can also add more contacts later by dragging and dropping them into the group. With these steps, you've successfully created a distribution list in Outlook from your Excel contacts, making it easier to manage and send emails to groups of people.